For the first time, I fell in love. I've gone out with girls before, but that was as far as his relationships went. Looking back, this was the first time I've ever felt so strongly about anyone. Um... Yes? Before, it was so easy to ask girls for their phone number. I didn't even bat an eyelid. But with her, it pained my heart so much just asking for her name. My throat was dry and my mind was blank. She was the only girl in the world to truly catch my eye. Are you okay? Your face is bright red. I'm just fine. If you don't mind me asking, uh, what's, what's your name? My name? Yes, if it's okay with you. My name? That's right. I'm Haru Hirayama. Haru Hirayama? Spring. <laughs> I think it suits you perfectly. Really? Absolutely. My name's Sakuma Kawai, by the way. After that, half a year had passed. You got it, Takuma? Yeah. You gotta be firm about Hirayama. Just go for it. But... No buts. What are you, a little kid? Everyone knows you like her, and not just us. Even the company knows you got the hearts for her. Seriously? It's so obvious from how you act. Anyway, our company has a social media with people from T-Corporation today, and all we're really trying to do, though, is to get two lovebirds to get their acts together. When you say lovebirds... I'm obviously talking about you and Hiroyama. She's a popular one, you know. Yeah, that makes sense. She's the cutest in the world. Wrong! My wife is the cutest in the world. That's a nice ring to it. Anyway, you better be ready. I mean it. You mean to confess to her? Oh, you really are a child. No, I'm talking on a mature level. I did a bit of digging, and the lucky lady seems to be looking for a relationship. Go and get her. Over here. Sorry for taking so long. Not at all. May I sit next to you? Go ahead. Thank you. Come on, Takuma, sit down next day, Rayama. Right, uh, good day. <laughs> D did I say something funny? It's already nighttime. Oh, you're right. It just feels bright and sunny whenever I see you, you know? <laughs> That's a weird thing to say. Yeah, I, I guess it is. Uh, maybe I'm just excited or something. <laughs> I get it. Anyway, uh, I guess I'll sit right here. All yours? We've hardly started, and they've got a good vibe going. For sure. Let's bring the beer over. I like how you think. I just like shoujo manga. Oh, I can't wait. Yeah, this will be good to watch. A toast! Cheers! Cheers. Oh, that hits the spot. Takuma, did you want some salad? Here. Oh, thank you. Is there anything else you like? Tomatoes? Actually, no, I'm fine. You don't like tomatoes, huh? You're just like a little kid. Do you have anything you don't like, Haru? Actually, I don't like tomatoes very much either. Oh, uh, yeah? Then are you calling a little kid? All right, you've got me. And that's how we start the night on a good vibe. Haru and I had a good conversation going. I was conscious of our co-workers looking at us, but just in the beginning... Before long, I had nothing on my mind except for Haru. I kept drinking, and so did she. Takuma, are you a strong drinker? Yeah, I am. Then here you go. How about you? Me too. Then here you go. <laughs> <laughs> this is so fun. Yeah, it really is. And the fun time continued. Listen, this is your chance to make your move. If you don't go for it, you know, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah? Don't go embarrassing her, either! Ah, got him. Alright, she got this! Huh? Where's Takuma? It's okay, he'll be here soon. Really? Really, just to be sure, you were wearing a matching set, right? Top and bottom? Of course! Wait, what are you talking about? You'll be fine, you got this. Um, okay... See you, Takuma! Take care of her the whole way! Got him. Good night, Haru. Get home safely. I will! Well, let's get going, then. Yeah. So, where's your... Hey, Takuma. Yeah? Do you want to drink a little longer? I'm in the mood for more. I'd love it if you would join me. Uh, of course. 
I'll join you for however many drinks you want. And so our night of fun continued longer. Huh, uh... Are you awake now? Takuma? Yeah, I'm here. W where? This is my place, uh, just so we're clear. I, I didn't drag you here. You asked to come over. I, I did? Huh? So does that mean you and I... Do you remember what happened last night? No, I don't. I see. I'm not sure if that's bad or good. What do you mean? Let me start by saying that I didn't do anything to you. Well, maybe I couldn't do anything would be more accurate. See, you still dress like you were last night. Y you're right. Did I cry again? Again? Has it happened before? Embarrassing as it is, yes. I see. Well, yes, when the mood hit you, you were crying inconsolably. And it made me feel really guilty. Then you fell asleep as soon as you calmed down. I'm so sorry. You were sobbing so hard, I wondered if I did something wrong. Do you dislike me? No, that's not it. Then, could you tell me why? I've never had one before. Huh? Promise you won't laugh. Of course I won't. I've never had a boyfriend before. Really? Yes, really. I went to an all-girls high school, and when I got to college, I didn't know how to approach guys. It was really scary for me. But I wanted a boyfriend, so I tried really hard at a lot of things. And then I relied on alcohol for whatever courage I lacked. But then I'd be a crying mess if I drank too much and no one would go out with me. So this has happened before? Yes. I think you're wrong about something. About what? I'm not the right guy to talk, but I don't think you need to hurry. You can take your time get into a relationship. Maybe. Just think about it. Okay. There are definitely guys who would force you into going out with them. If I was like that, I'd be complete trash. The, the girl would probably be scarred for life. But... No buts. Please, let me say this. You're definitely not like that, right, Takuma? Who knows? I might have held myself back this time, but what about next time? You held back? Of course I did, because I really like you. <laughs> um... Forgive me for making assumptions, but I think you're a good person. After all, you were still next to me when I woke up. You're the first guy to do that. You're the first guy to tell me off about my concerns, too. Ah, dang it. All right. Yes? I really like you. Will you go out with me? I'd love to. Then, um... But I can't. I'm sorry. But why not? Even if we're dating, I probably wouldn't be ready so soon. I think you'd be forced to keep waiting on me. I'm fine with that. I'll wait until you feel ready, Haru. I'll wait forever if I have to. It'd only be about a year. One year is fine. It could even be five years or ten years and it'd be fine. Can guys really wait that long? I will. So please don't go drinking and crying for other guys. If you did, I, I'd be really sad. All right, then. If you really don't mind. Do you mean? We're officially a couple starting today. Is that okay? Perfect. Thank you, Haru. After this, the two of us went on lots of dates. Haru, over here! Sorry, were you waiting long? That's okay. Waiting's part of the day. Ugh, no fair. Then I'll have to come early next time. Shall we? Yep. Thanks for inviting me to see the movie. No problem. I didn't know you were also keeping up with the series. Do you like the anime? I love it. I underestimated you. I own a Blu-ray box and have seen the show ten times. Seriously? I've only seen it five times. Wow. Looks like I win. <sighs> I really want that postcard. My favorite character's on it. The character's a girl, though. Huh? Does that matter? She's the cutest, and she works so hard. You're right, doesn't matter. Can I have it, if it's okay? Of course, here. Yay! I'll go and get us drinks. Then I'll get the popcorn. As the movie reached its ending, I heard the girl next to me sniffling. Glancing from the corner of my eye, tears were streaming down Haru's face. 
the trail left by Hara's tears were glistening in the dim light. The most beautiful girl in the world was right next to me. Aru got embarrassed when she caught me staring at her. At that moment, the most beautiful girl became even more beautiful. A smile is also the best in the world. I was so amazed. Everything I wanted to see was in the movie. I want to see it again when they changed the attendance gift. You should come with me. I caught you crying during the movie. Uh, it's so embarrassing when you stare at me. More than that, it's rude. You should be watching the movie when you're in the theater. But you're so pretty. I love looking at you. You get no brownie points for sweet-talking me. Yeah, but it's true, though. I didn't think you were so comfortable with complimenting girls. What do you mean? When we first met, you were so nervous, you could barely ask for my first name, right? It made me wonder if maybe you were like me. Like you found someone who could understand you? Something like that. Hmm, well, I can't say I've been in that many relationships, but probably more than most. I see. Is something wrong with that? Hmm, I wish I could have been your first. But on the other hand, I'm glad that you could take the lead on dates and things. I'm glad to hear that. Oh, but there is one thing. What is it? You're the first girl I fell in love with and the first girl I've ever asked out. Uh, really? Yes. I'm really happy to hear that. Should we get moving? I got us a reservation at a really nice Italian place. Sounds great. But you're going easy on the wine. <laughs> Fine. So, those are the kinds of dates we've been on. Are you for real? What do you mean? All those dates, not a single kiss. Yeah, I guess not, but I did promise her. Besides, I'm super happy. You know, those kinds of dates. Seriously, Haru? What do you mean? And you two still haven't kissed? No, but he did promise he'd wait. Besides, I'm really happy even without the kissing and stuff. Is this really healthy for you? You're both grown adults, you know. Yeah, what's wrong with it if we're both satisfied with our current relationship? Okay, but where's all the action? Hey, it's rude to put it that way. You sure you're okay? You're both adults, you know. And Takuma and I are perfectly happy with each other right now. I guess, but these are all kitty dates. What's that supposed to mean? You sure you're okay? You're finally going out with the love of your life. It doesn't kill you that you can't, you know, turn up the heat with her? Sure, it's tough sometimes, but I want to make sure I see Haru smile first. Shows you a man of good, no, of great character. You're making fun of me. Yeah, it's a compliment. I couldn't do what you're doing. Anyway, like I said, we're fine with how things are right now. We promised we'll take it slow with our relationship. At the very least, that's how I felt. Are you sure this isn't too hard on Takuma? I heard that it's really painful for a guy to go out with a girl that he loves, but he's unable to do anything with her. What? Is that really true? You should probably realize just how much he's spoiling you. Otherwise, you might get dumped no matter how many times he says he's head over heels for you. Me? Dumped? Before that happens, Haru, are you okay? You're so pale. I don't feel well. Oh no, why don't you take a break? I'll manage things on my own somehow. Thank you. I should be grateful for her advice, but at the moment, Takuma telling me he'd wait forever played a repeat in my head. I probably am being spoiled by him. Hey, Haru, I just got off of work. I was wondering if you'd like to go out for dinner tonight, Haru? Haru, uh, do you hear me? Sorry, I don't feel very well today. Haru, are you crying? H how do you know? Because I'm your boyfriend, that's why. Where are you right now? I'll come to you. Please, don't. Why not? Stop being so nice to me. She hung up after that. And so I ran to a company, to her apartment, to places we've been together. I looked for her. My lungs, my legs, my whole body was screaming in agony. But my heart was even in more pain as the sound of horror crying echoed in my ears. Please, please don't cry alone. If she was going to cry, I wanted to cry in my arms. I'd also be able to wipe away her tears. <laughs> Haru! Oh, thank goodness I found you. Takuma? Looks like I've won our game of hide and seek. What are you doing here? I'd come to you, it's like I told you. Although it took me a lot longer than I thought. Sorry about that. Why? Why are you so 
so nice to me. What do you mean, why? I've been making you wait on me this whole time. Well, all I do is take and take. You're always so nice. Tell me, will you hate me one day? Haru? I was talking to a co-worker today. She said all I was doing was making you hold back for me. That I'm being spoiled and that eventually you're going to get tired of me. And I think she's right. But I'm still so scared. I'm scared of so much. Like I'm a child. If we keep going out, I do think you'll probably have to keep waiting for me. But what really scared me was when she said that you might dump me. Just thinking about it hurt so much. I started crying. What am I feeling right now? I don't know what this is. It scares me. Oh, please don't be angry at me for this. I'm really happy that you told me all this. You're happy? I am because this shows me that you really do love me. I'll never get tired of loving you. Because I love you so much. I told you, didn't I? I told you I'd wait for you. And I mean it, so please trust me. Please don't turn me into a liar. And if you really want to know why I'm so nice to you... Yes? It's because I have my motive. I love you, so I want you to love me back. That's why I'm so nice. I love you, so you're precious to me. You have no reason to feel like you owe me anything. Can I be as nice as you? Can I love you just as much back? I want to do more for you. I want to treasure you. Of course you can. You're so kind and beautiful when you cry over me. R really? I guess that's fine. To be honest, I'd love to kiss you right here and now, but I'm going to keep my promise. But whenever your heart feels ready. When that time comes, I'd be the one to kiss you. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it. Don't worry, I think that time will come sooner than you think. Before we knew it, the cherry blossoms began to bloom. Spring was already upon us. Oh, I don't like that I'm coming with Sakuba. Same as driving me nuts! Cut it out, I'm the one who hates this the most. See, they're glaring again! Don't glare back and just deal with it. What did Takuma even do? Him? Last year he went so hard after the most popular receptionist at this company that she quit. Well, that's awful. I'm not the bad guy. What is the truth? See? The proof is glittering right there. Oh, that's what you mean by acquitting. That explains your evil eyes. Okay, enough with the banter. Let's go. Hey, what are you doing staring off into space, huh? Your beloved wife doesn't work here anymore. Uh, how long are you going to keep teasing me about this? Until I'm bored of it. <laughs> You're the worst. But I don't want to get married too. How'd you land that beloved receptionist? Tell me how you did it. He took her home with him after a drinking party. Except he took her home and didn't do a thing. <laughs> Can you believe him? Seriously? It's fine. We're both perfectly happy right now. Mmm, that's a scent of cherry blossoms in the air. Try to change the subject. Yep, spring had come for us. And it came much sooner than expected. It didn't have to take five or ten years for Haru and I to be showered with sunlight in our relationship. 